New here at 11 o'clock, a serious case of child abuse. Two parents accused of repeatedly locking their children in a room in an apartment covered in feces and urine. And according to reports obtained by the 8 News Now investigators, authorities were called by a maintenance man fixing a window. 8 News Now anchor Sasha Loftus joining us live in the newsroom tonight with members of the community and what they now, Sasha, are saying. Denise and Brian, people we spoke with tonight say it's startling to hear something like this was happening. This case, unfortunately, not the first of its kind here in Las Vegas over the past few years. A warning, this story may be disturbing to some. And it's shocking, and you think, how could that happen? Shocking and sad. Just several ways community members describe a severe child abuse case. Whether it's children or animals, just the abuse that happens is heartbreaking. Two parents accused of locking several children in a room covered in feces and urine at this apartment complex near MLK and Owens. According to a police report obtained by the 8 News Now investigators, a maintenance worker fixing a window called police last week after seeing a three-year-old girl lying on a mattress with feces and urine. And when officers got there, they reportedly found feces on the walls, spoiled food, bugs, and locks on the bedroom door to, quote, lock the girls in at night. This comes several months after an 11-year-old boy with autism was found locked in a makeshift cage in Henderson. Come on. Come right, on, baby, man. Come on. And more than a year after six children were found severely abused in this apartment, with two of them locked in dog cages. It just makes my heart hurt for every child who's suffering right now that we don't know about. Those we spoke with say stories like this are horrible to hear, and they hope anyone who needs to will speak up in the future. If there's something suspicious going on or you're noticing something, to just question. While the children's ages were redacted in the documents, their birth years indicate they are between ages of three and nine. Denise. Sasha, thanks for that. The parents arrested in this case each now face four counts of felony child abuse, a judge releasing them on their own recognizance and ordering the pair to comply with Child Protective Services. Both of them are due back in Justice Court at the end of November.